the new president of Panama, José Raúl Molino, will face the formidable task of trying to unite a country exhausted by years of a declining economy and pervasive corruption. I have a popular mandate that legitimizes me before you and the rest of the country. I'm not here because someone put me here or because someone's finger handed me the majority against eight other presidential candidates. We're here ready to face this tremendous responsibility. Mulino, right-wing former security minister, replaced ex-president Ricardo Martinelli at the top of the ticket. Martinelli was barred from running after being sentenced to 10 years in prison for money laundering. On Sunday after casting his vote, Mulino visited Martinelli at the Nicaraguan embassy, where he was granted asylum in March. Despite his conviction, Martinelli, a business tycoon, remains popular among Panamanians who remember his presidency from 2009 to 2014 as a time of economic prosperity, unlike now. Everything is worse now, people don't feel safe anymore, food is super expensive. Sadly, the minimum wage is just $500, when the basic food basket is almost $400 per month. What's left for the poor Panamanian? Nothing. This is a rich country blessed by God. The inequality is unacceptable and we need to reduce the gap. Many Panamanians took to the streets in mass rallies last year to protest against corruption and the high cost of living. They were angry about a copper mine contract they say affected the environment and was riddled with political graft. Constitutional law professor Miguel Antonio Bernal says Mulino will face many challenges, including a troubled pension and health system, high levels of public debt and recurring droughts affecting the Panama Canal. Panamanians are going through very difficult times. The high cost of living, the out-of-control public debt drought. There is no medicine in the hospitals. The truth is that this country is a disaster. Unless real and effective change comes, this is going to explode. Molino is promising to bring back the good times that many Panamanians feel they had under Martinelli and is promising to keep him out of prison. But most people believe that unless he'll be able to show results quickly, Panamanians could rapidly turn their backs on him. Alessandro Rampietti, Al Jazeera, Panama. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to get the latest news from Al Jazeera.